So I think you can be really happy about yourself because you've done all of that up until the kernel address revelation. In the following part, we're going to see how we can actually win the race condition as for now, we use the debugger to help us win the race. And we're going to see how we can build an arbitrary read-write primitive, because for now, we just leaked two kernel addresses, the k thread and the k resource manager. So we don't even have an arbitrary read primitive yet. And so we're going to see why leaking these two kernel addresses will allow us to actually build an arbitrary write primitive. And once we get the arbitrary read-write primitive, we are going to see how we can swap our own process token to get system privileges. And so you'll be able to finally pop a system shell. I really hope you enjoyed the training so far and I'll see you next in another video.